solve the literal equation. So we have v equals one-third pi r squared h. And in this problem, we're trying to solve for little h. So little h is over here at the end. So we can do this in one step, or we can do it in multiple steps. Let's do it in maybe like two or three steps, just to make it a little bit easier, I think. So the first thing um, that's kind of uncomfortable is this fraction. So let's go ahead and get rid of the fraction. To do that, um, you can just multiply by 3, because that'll get rid of the 3 on the bottom. So 3v is equal to 3 times 1 third pi r squared h. You see, and now they, they cancel, they go away. So you have 3v equals pi r squared h. All right, so we're looking for h, and it's being multiplied by pi r squared. So in order to undo that, we have to use the opposite operation of multiplication, which is division. So let's divide both sides by pi r squared, divide by pi r squared. So this goes away. So we have 3v over pi r squared, and that's equal to h. And that's it. Now, if you want to make it look better, what you can do is you can put the h on the left-hand side like this. So h equals 3v over pi r squared. And that would be the final answer.